Hey everybody, how's it going? So, uh, a couple things. I took the Camaro out for a ride the other day, and uh, only twice has it really let me down. Uh, this was one of the times. Um, it left me stranded. It wasn't the Camaro's fault. Uh, that new Holly system that I bought, the bracket system that I thought looked so good and looked so strong, well, it let me down. So, let's go over a few things. One, I lost a real nice, expensive idler pulley. Um, I'm going to have to reorder eventually. But, um, so, when I was running the GM one, the factory one with the eBay AC relocator kit and all the stacked brackets, I had the belt squeal and it got on my nerves. Couldn't, couldn't get rid of it. Uh, I've got belt laser lining tools and everything else. Couldn't get rid of it. So I bought that Holly system, and when I did, I noticed that my GM, on the GM side, okay, your alternator sits here, power steering pump sits here, idler pulley sits here. This all looks good, but uh, when I pulled off the power steering pump, as you can see, it almost completely busted off. So I was like, thank goodness. I'm glad I, I, I was changing it. So, hmm, caught that one just in time. Well, needless to say, out for my little cruise, and there's the Holly. Alternator sets here, power string pump sets here, and right about here is where the idler pulley set. As you see, it snapped it there, there, there. And it also cracked it all the way through and almost broke off this whole section here. So, I got on the phone with my good friends at Holly, who didn't answer. And after sitting on hold for eternity, and it, you know, I have sat on hold for Jags for a long time too. Right now, it's just, you know, everybody's working from home, so... I understand it, and I'm not saying anything bad about Holly on that part, uh, even though I normally wait on hold with them for a long time. Either way, it doesn't matter. Um, this time it was even longer. So I called up Jags, and Jags looked it up and uh, said that um, I guess Holly claims that that's for stock replacement only. It's not made for a motor with any power other than stock it can't handle it obviously um so i had jegs look and see if there was anything that could handle it they came up with one system uh i'm in the process of putting it on right now it's from ict now if you watch my other videos you know ict is the one i put on the 55 and i did not like it uh it's you're stacking brackets but the problem with the 55 wasn't and i said it in the video ict's fault it was the guy ordered it he didn't have the right water pump for it he didn't have the right alternator for it uh, he didn't have the right parts for the part that he ordered so i had to totally customize it and it was a pain in the ass um, once again that wasn't their fault so with that being said, and knowing that wasn't their fault, I went ahead and ordered it, and I'm in the process of putting it on. I also ordered this new front cover right there, force more air through the radiator. But so I still got to pull off the AC side, put it on, and finish putting on this side. The idler pulley on this one's a lot nicer because the idler pulley sits right here. And it goes completely through to the block. So it'll be bolted to the block. Where with the Holly system, it was just hanging out there with no bolts. It wasn't bolted to the block. Um, the power steering, however, is just kind of hanging out there. Um, but it will be supported from this side and the back side. Where with the Holly system, it was only supported on the back side 
and the same with the GM. You had one bolt that went right here and a bracket that went over. That didn't support shit, obviously. GM did the same thing. Um, this one here, all three bolts will run through here, through the power steering pump, and into the uh, back bracket. Actually, two bolts will. Two bolts will run straight through all the way through. One bolt will just bolt to right here. Uh, so, and that's going to be a whole lot stronger than what I had. So, so I'm in the process of putting that on. Um, and that's where I'm at. So, just a quick update on that. Like I said, uh, I'm going to order another pulley to match the other ones. Not high happy about that. That wasn't, you know, it's a expensive pulley, but uh, it is what it is. And this is the old system I had that I can't stand. I just hate stacking a bunch of crap on top of each other like that. And unfortunately, this is the AC side, and it's the same way. The only good thing is, I think this is a. Yeah, this is a whole lot thicker aluminum. One of these is almost as thick as both of those. So, I'm holding out on good uh, good hopes. It'll be a good system. Uh, Jeg said that they haven't had any problems or complaints with it. So, we'll see. Well, that looks like crap over there. I hear it thundering. But, damn, oh, there's my truck. But anyhow, that's uh, that's where I'm at on that. I'm gonna swap this stuff over and uh, see if I can get this thing up and going. So, comment, share, like, let me know what you think.